Hey there, baseball fans. It's Ben, and I'm back with another finishing of uh, opening packs of baseball cards. This box here is 1992 Donruss Triple Play, the first edition of that year. And I've got about uh, nine or so packs left in this factory sealed box that I was able to snag. And I do love this set because of just how fun it is. It brings baseball collecting back to, into kids' world with just some fun facts, and it's not all about, uh, you know, high premium quality cards and collective edition things that really just talks about the game and how fun it is. So we're going to go through these, looking for some of my favorite players and some Hall of Famers and anything else that's interesting. All right, who do you think that is? My guess is Cal Ripken Jr. Actually, I don't know that I've seen this card before. Now he's one of the best to ever play the game, and a great guy off the field, too. This is his 12th year with the Orioles. He's Cal Ripken. I actually never, I don't know that I saw that card before, so we'll put that one aside. That's a fun one. Look at that. Chuck Finley crashing into Gary Carter there. There's Bob Thig Bobby Thigpin. There's Steve Avery. Gary Bargetti, Cecil Fielder after his famous 50 home run year. Barry Bonds, another home run hitter in his own like. Randy Johnson, what a good pack this is now. Poor Randy gets his face obscured by a baseball. Uh, this one is who? Dale Murphy? No, Scott Sanderson. There you go. And there's Larry Walker. That was a great pack. Holy cow. Lots of good uh, Hall of Fame quality players in there. Even if not all of them are in the Hall of Fame for various reasons. Hint, hint, wink, wink, wink. Wow. I think we've got, so we've opened three packs. We've got three Rafael Palmeiras. And uh, Darren Jackson. There's the Eck. Dennis Eckersley. There's a card about the Hall of Fame. If you've never been there. It's pretty awesome. I got to play Abner Doubleday Field at the Hall of Fame when I was a, a Babe Ruth player in high school, which is really cool. There's Vince Coleman, Kirby Puckett, Jose Canseco, Tom Glavin. Oh my goodness, what a stretch. And great Greg Maddox. That, that pack even beat the last one. That is a fun, exciting pack. If you're a kid and you get that uh, run of great players, you're pretty darn excited right now. And honestly, if you're not a kid like me, you're still excited. Bill Gullickson. Gullickson. I don't know anything about Bill Gullickson. I feel like he might be one of those guys, one of those cards where it's like, whatever happened to that guy? I'm not sure how long he was in the league. Let's put him aside for now. Good shot of Kevin Elster. Fredo Alomar, Chris Sabo, Tony Fernandez, jumping over Ryan Sandberg. This, these, this set of cards actually has a very specific smell to it, too, which I really enjoy. It's kind of weird. That's a great picture of Will Clark wearing the throwback uniform there. I love that. There's Dave Justice. Gary Gaetti. Oh, Ryan Sandberg, one of my faves. Makes me happy whenever I get one of my favorites in there. I can add my personal collection. Soon I'll do a video kind of about my personal collection. There's... Ken Griffey Jr., we'll put him aside. Our pack of uh, Hall of Famers and Stars is almost as tall as our stack of commons coming out of these. Pretty good so far. I'd say this is a pretty good session. Carlton Fisk. There you go. Don Mattingly, another good one. Love that card. Good shot of Travis Fireman there. Juan Gonzalez. Again, just a really good job by this set of capturing the fun of the game. Um, I like the next, uh, this is the first year of this set, and um, the next year, which is Don Mattingly, 
I liked how the nice design too with the black border. And some more of the, who was that when they were younger? Is Mike Messina. All right, who's this one? Brett Butler. There you go. So good job on this one, Donruss Leaf. Oh, there's Gallery of Stars, Frank Viola. You know, I've gotten quite a few of these now. I don't think I've gotten any of them that are people that I would consider um, ones that I'd put aside, <laughs> which is a shame, because they're beautiful looking cards. Fun, too. All right, and on to the last pack. I do hope I run across uh, some more unopened packs of these at some point in the near future, because I do love this set. There's Cal Ripken, kind of an odd shot. Wade Boggs, looking good. Fielding, which is always funny because he's always considered such a great hitter. There's Gerald Strawberry. Barry Larkin. And that'll finish it up. What a good session there. Look at this giant stack. Plus we got the Ryan Sandberg. Now let's find out who Phil Gullickson is and whatever happened to him. Not much to go on on the back here. Not even doesn't even tell you where he's from. Let's go to our favorite little Wikipedia here. Phil Gullickson. There you go. From Minnesota. Major League player, pitcher who played in Canada, the U.S., and Japan. 18 years in professional baseball. 14 seasons in the major league, in the majors in, in the U.S. That's I had no idea. So he started in 1979 for the Expos. And, and then uh, Japan in 1988. Last year was 1994 for the Tigers. And the last time in Japan was 89. He was 162 and 136 with a 393 earned runner average, 1,200 strikes. That's really a solid career. Solid career there. Like Mark Gubitska we looked at last time. Very good. See him more about his, his family here. Six children. Oh my goodness. Daughter track and field at Notre Dame. Daughter was a professional tennis player. Um, women's singles tennis player. Her, his other daughter. Son is a standout pitcher in high school. And we went to Clemson and played. Um, another daughter who was a strength instructor on Peloton. That's really cool. So if you guys uh, do some workouts with Callie Gullickson, that is Bill Gullickson's daughter, professional baseball player. Crazy. And then his other daughter, another tennis player, professional tennis player. So that is pretty remarkable. Bill, nice work. Nice, long, 18-year professional baseball career. And six kids that are all uh quality athletes that is just remarkable bill i got a new respect for you so hats off to you bill show me what i missed there hope you guys enjoyed that one i'll see you next time